guys, welcome to Vlogmas. So I'll stop calling it Linmas because <laughs> people seem to hate it. So I'm just getting ready for the day. I wanna say personally, thank you everyone for the birthday wishes for Becky. It's very appreciated. Um, I'm about to do some dry shampoo. This one is the best. It's the Bautiste Instant Hair Refresh Dry Shampoo, clean and original. Get it, works very well. I usually just let it sit. So this is how I look with gray hair. Yeah, no. never gonna happen. <laughs> Where did I put? Oh, okay. Thought I lost the back to the earring. Do you guys ever have that thing where it's like, okay, you have a closet full of clothes, but you still feel like you have absolutely nothing to wear? That's definitely the worst feeling. So I do have uh, two YouTube comments I want to read. I just was skimming them a little bit earlier when I woke up. So we're going to do that here in a minute. I mainly just want the dry shampoo right here because that's how I want to part my hair. I also really like dry shampoo because it's like, it kind of gives a little volume. Not gonna lie. So I'm gonna put on some lip stuff. I'm gonna be using Buxom in the color Sugar. It is a, a plumping lip polish, but let's be real. My lips are super small, so it doesn't really work. But I love this stuff. Smells good, feels good, looks good. Sometimes a girl just needs some gloss, you know? Some lip plumper hurts really bad, but this doesn't. I will say though, that compared to other lip plumpers I have used in the past, I feel this one on my tongue and I don't feel any others on my tongue, so weird. Okay, so the two YouTube comments I want to read. So I feel like this person explained things a little better. Some people explain things better than I can or like better than I can convey. A lot of people are having issues with like Becky buying me gifts, saying that it's like my money and blah, blah, blah. But this person said, it's not unheard of for couples to share or use the same money even if only one works. It's a thought that counts and it doesn't matter what money Becky is using to buy Amber's gifts. People be trying way too hard to find something to criticize. Can they just have happy moments like everybody else? They're cute and I'm happy for them. Thank you, by the way. Yeah, I 100% agree. I don't care where Becky gets the money as long as she's not hurting herself and her and I do share the same bank account and share the same money. It is very common for if YouTubers make enough money, then their significant other just stays home with them. And I just think it's crazy that like, what we do with our money is like so talked about because it's really no one else's business. One of the biggest rumors is that people think that Becky's on like welfare or something. No, she is not. So the next comment says, Becca, Dana, and Destiny all lost their mothers this year and Amberlynn lost her uterus. And it's so heartbreaking that to hear them laughing is a joy and a treat. Being light in your heart is key to surviving tragedy and they will endure if they all lean on each other. Be well. I read this and teared up because it's true. Um, it's been a hard year for all of us and when we all come together, there's a sense of like, especially for the three of them, they all understand and have gone through the exact same thing this year. And it's just sad to see the comments, people trying to tear each other down and tear Becky down and tear Destiny and Dana and me. It's just like, why can't, there be more positivity. It is not uncommon for exes to stay friends. I don't even think think of Destiny as an ex anymore. We're all just friends and people just can't let stuff go. And I don't think anyone understands how much Becky actually loves Dana and Destiny. And people just assume that it's like me who invited them over and it's not <laughs> at all. All right, you guys, it's time for, what is this? Day uh, 12? Day 12. Mm -hmm. Becky has not slept all night. No. And it is really hot. 
mainly because I was outside and it's like 60 something degrees outside and I get hot really easily. Yeah, so she looks super tired. That's why for some reason she couldn't fall asleep. She's been having really bad RLS, so. Yes. Even like my like prescribed medicine like isn't really helping anymore, you know. Oh, baby, you need to see a doctor. I know. But on a lighter note, here you go. Please not let <laughs> Ooh. These are so pretty. I love the color. I do too. Love them. That's um, mainly why I got them was the color. Yeah. I honestly love these so much. They're very pretty. I'm going to wear them soon. Yes, I am. They wouldn't match your one yellow like sweater thing, but that's kind of too matchy-matchy, isn't it? Yeah, I, w I don't think I would wear yellow earrings with a yellow sweater. Yeah, that's just, too much. You know, it depends on how I feel. So the lighting is kind of bad when I'm showing you. So how do we want to do this? Well, I look like a hot mess anyway, so the less they see, the better. <laughs> Babe, that is not true. Okay. All right, your gift time. Oh, boy. I actually do not know where this one is located today. Oh, there it is, right in front of my face. I wasn't expecting this shape. Okay, what do you think that is with that shape? I honestly don't know. It's like opening and everything. It's only a hat. All right. Oops. Oh, that is so cute. Look at that. It's like a little pride. Yeah, I um I wanted you to get like a pride hat, so I just typed in LGBT hats. That's cute, babe. And I like that one a lot. If there's ever a freaking pride again because of COVID, I'm gonna wear this. Oh yeah. Thank you, baby. You should try it on. You're welcome. Oh, you want me to try it on? Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's hold on. Cause I got a round head. No. <laughs> Well, I mean, everyone has a round head. It looks good. Does it fit well? Mm hmm Feels nice? It does. Hi, baby. Oh, look. There's a little Carter. A quarter. They've had Carter for um, almost four years. I just thought I'd... Just thought I'd say, huh? Say, I'm, I'm not a new... A I'm not a new new. I'm not a new new. No. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Oh, gee, Louise. Can't stand it. I'm trying to make it to where he doesn't like pull down my shirt and show my cleave or fall, yeah. He's such a loving little baby. Yeah, he is a sweetheart. Look at this. That'd be loud. Okay, so I have a little haul moment. I don't remember even what I ordered from two of these packages, but here's one. Oh, wait, before I do the haul, Becky's taking a nap, by the way, so she can't film me. But I forgot to open the um, the um, garbage pill kids. Becky said I could do it while she's napping. So, all right. So today is day twelve. Whoa! And we have hot Scott. That is um terrifying. Can you mute that, homie? I don't know if that's copyright or not, so that's why. All right. So Dana is watching me, and you're gonna, if you watch the video, you're going to see what I edit out versus what I keep. <laughs> the other day, my video, when I put it into iMovie, it was 45 minutes long, but then after I was done editing it, it went all the way down to 24 minutes. So that's how much I take out sometimes. Okay, so I got a Christmas movie called last christmas so you know that's that we should definitely watch something like that tonight you want to yeah. i keep probably would what is this whatever this is it's not in my it's in amber reed instead of amberlin reed so i wonder what it could be because a lot of my stuff is in amberlin reed Oh, it's literally Sephora. It says right here. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I ordered some makeup. 
I ordered some Rare Beauty products because um, I ordered their eyeliner and I actually really like it. So I decided to order more. Okay, so this is a liquid touch brush. It's just a foundation brush, literally. That's all it is. It just looks like this. Super cute. What I like about Rare Beauty is like, it's also simplistic looking and I love that. So we got some liquid touch weightless foundation. Like wait until you see how cute this looks. Look, okay, so this might be way too light for me cause I got number 110. Oh boy, yeah, this is gonna be too light. Like look, holy moly. I just wanna test it. Okay, yeah, we need to get a darker shade, I'm thinking. I mean, that would be good to use for, like, concealer or something. Um, I don't know. I'm definitely going to test it out. And I might have to get the shade one shade higher than that, which is totally fine. It's just really hard to find your right shade. I mean, James Charles is, like, makeup guru of the world, and he still has a problem. So um, I have some Always an Optimist Illuminating primer so that is what it looks like I accidentally, accidentally put a little too much but oh i love how it feels and looks girl i actually really like this next we have brow harmony crayon and gel so it's literally an eyebrow moment we have an eyebrow brush and on the other side we have the eyebrow pencil. So I'm excited to try all of this. The last thing is some matte liquid blush and I got it in the color Bliss. So I know for a fact I'm going to absolutely love this. I just love their packaging, it's so cute. So everything looks great. I'm just actually really sad about the foundation color but I think we can make this work. Maybe with um, some of the blush, it'll make it look just like a little bit darker or whatever. All right, so I have one more box and it is um, Bath and Body Works. I'm glad Becky's not in here because I actually got her a gift. <laughs> I got her another Christmas gift, so don't say anything, anyone. Thank you. All right, so I got kind of a lot. <laughs> I must have been manic. Okay, look. It's kind of a lot. Um, I'm not gonna show everything. That's just crazy. I got some wallflowers, sweater weather, the perfect Christmas, um, black tie, yum. Marshmallow fireside, you know. Black tie's my favorite one. It smells bomb, ain't it? Not with the holidays. <laughs> And I'm not gonna show what I got Becky, but um, I also got frosted coconut snowball and evergreen. Sometimes how they package this stuff is terrible. crazy. And then I got me some lotion. I got the snowflakes and cashmere. I've never actually smelt this before. That's Dana one that has that one. Are you serious? Yes, it smells so good, you're gonna love it. Oh girl, it's that smells favorites. great. That one and the, um, what is it? the champagne toast. Are two of my favorite that's, scents. That's the one that I always use. How weird. So when I wrap all this, should I just keep it in like one box? Yeah. Or should I do it all individual? No. Yeah. Oh, that's all right. I'm glad they packaged their games better. You remember how they used to in like those cartons? Yeah. I don't think that's not so good. No, it's not. And then I got this um, wallflower. I thought it was super cute. It goes with my aesthetic, kind of. Because it's cute. <laughs> And then I got one more of those. Ooh, I like that one. That's I know, cute. isn't it so cute? That looked really good in your guys' room. What are you doing? There we go. I also got some, um, what do they call these? Room sprays, marshmallow fireside, um, gingham, I'm probably saying that wrong. Um, eucalyptus mint, holiday, black tie, um, Fresh Balsam, Frozen Lake, you know, just random ones like that. Flannel, which is one of my absolute favorites. 
winter bergamot waters and endless weekend which is also another one of my favorites so just some random some random so okay i just me and dana just figured out a word that's kind of like gross like moist secretes <laughs> secretes just sounds really gross <laughs> so here's an update on our life Dana's doing her full face of makeup over here in the dark, like a pro. Destiny is wrapping gifts, and Becky is eating icy slushy water. slushy water, and Santa Claus is on. And I'm waiting for Starbucks. I decided to get a frap. So, this is what Carter's doing. This is what Twinkie's doing. I'm a dog whisperer. If we put 30 on here, the house would have burned down. Should have done the one in the middle first. Are you singing too? You gotta wait till we all start singing. Ow. Here. <laughs> you gotta wait till we all start singing, Twain. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, baby. <laughs> Happy birthday. Child, <laughs> that wouldn't lit back up. Did you see it? Becky's favorite cake. And many more. Thirty flirty. On channel four. And a big fat lady on channel eighty. And Scooby Doo. Oh, what? On channel two. I was about to say, am I, I the fat lady <laughs> on channel eighty? I've only ever heard it many more on channel four. <laughs> yeah. Me too. Me too. Four. Frankenstein on channel one nine. Smell like one too. Oh yeah, yeah. Or what something are, about a garbage can. <laughs> have you heard of the Frankenstein on channel nine? No, that's a good one. Oh wow. Huh. I don't know what other ones I've heard. So does everyone have their yes. their thing that they're gonna do? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. <laughs> okay. So we have Alice in Bone Ranger. It sounds like porn. <laughs> <laughs> we have Alice in Booty Call. <laughs> that is porn. Hmm? Can you tell them what your cough is, please? It's allergies. I went and got it checked out. Can you tell them what yours is? Oh, I smoke cigarettes. <laughs> okay, <it's> just, <laughs> no one's sick, okay? Alice in Booty Call. We have Dawn of the Anti-Vaxxers. Oh my god. <laughs> and we have Boys in the Urine Soaked Hankies. <laughs> so now we all get to vote on who they think did the best and whoever is gets this a... card not with it or is it no oh, that's first. mine sorry okay. we can't we vote for ourselves did it say that's a negative okay i think that's just being biased you know so it's like yeah i thought so cool. <laughs> i was gonna say everybody's gonna pick their own card yeah so everyone on the count of three point to their favorite by pointing to the white card okay ready set go Okay, so whoever anti vaxxers is one. That you? Be... Woo! Yeah, I that take was. Both of them, right? That was funny. I take both of them. Is that what it said? Yeah, you could take both. Okay. Okay, so we're finally having some of the cake. I'm gonna do a little taste test moment. You don't like it? I don't think I've ever had it. Oh, that's just chocolate cake with coconut. Oh. Uh. I bet you'll like it. You like coconut, don't you? Mm hmm. Not me. It's good. The only time I've ever like had something that had coconut in it that I liked, um, one of my friends made a big snowball cake, and she used like fresh coconut, and that was really good. And you actually ate it? Ooh, yeah, yeah, I actually liked it. It's a big one. Destiny, you want to do a taste I, test? I love how good it smells. I've had one. You've had it? Oh. What do you think? It's good. Oh my god. Have, good. You, have you guys ever had strawberry poke cake? No. Mm. What is that? Oh my. Yes, baby. You have had it. I've had strawberry poke cake? Yeah. My mom would make it all the time. Oh, with the holes? Yeah. She would uh, mm. take a strawberry jello mix, mm -hmm. but not let it become jello. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. After the yellow cake was done, she would poke holes in it and pour the jello liquid in there. 
and it like soaks into the cake. And then you like make the top with like uh, Cool Whip and other stuff like powdered sugar, you know, sugar and stuff like that. It's so good. That, that sounds good. good. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, yeah, I think I like that better than this. Carter said, I want to buy it. You can't have that. <laughs> oh, he's gone. So you guys want to play Loaded Questions? Yes. Yes. What do you think, babe? Mm-hmm. Zero through ten. On the cake? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Eight. I give it like a 6.5. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is it dry? No. No. Yeah. I think no. probably what I'm not a big fan about it is this kind of awesome. Really? What yeah. don't you like about it? Do you like whipped icing? I like like... The actual kind that you get out of like Burberry. a Duncan Hans thing. Like yes. milk chocolate. You know? Yeah. This is like a fondant top deal. I also have some milk. Fudge. I love whipped buttercream. It's my favorite. I think I, that's my fave too. I'll tell y'all, this cake is good and moist. It's nice. <laughs> Hi, baby. Oh my goodness. Carter is a little babe. Where'd you buy that? Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> Are you talking? That's why. <laughs> oh my god, so cute. So you guys are currently sitting on my washer. I need some advice. So I have this black blanket that is so staticky that it like sticks together. And I did look online for some help to make it not staticky. The biggest thing it said is put it in the dryer with some of these good ends right here. Just some like dryer sheets or whatever and that it'll help i don't know you guys are smart tell me in the comments below what you think would help to completely take away all the static like it's so bad i can't even sleep with it it's actually like highly miserable to the point of like i can't even touch it to put it in the dryer so i am just getting ready for bed obviously i'm gonna brush my teeth Take a real quick shower because I'm not washing my hair. Oh, there's a little kitty. There's a little kitty saying meow. Hi, my baby. So, yeah, I just wanted to end this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. And Becky says thank you so much for all of the birthday wishes. And we will see you in tomorrow's video. Oh, you want to say thank you? Thanks, guys. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.